The President's Intelligence Advisory Board PIAB, is an advisor to the Executive Office of the President of the United States. According to its self-description, it provides advice to the President concerning the quality and adequacy of intelligence collection, of analysis and estimates, of counterintelligence, and of other intelligence activities." The PIAB, through its Intelligence Oversight Board also advises the President on the legality of foreign intelligence activities. History In January 1956 Dwight D. Eisenhower created the agency, originally known as the President's Board of Consultants on Foreign Intelligence Activities The first board under Chair James Killian were Richard Connolly Jimmy Doolittle Benjamin Fairless John Hull Joe Kennedy Robert Lovett Edward Ryerson In May 1961, John F. Kennedy renamed it to the President's Foreign Intelligence Advisory Board the board exists at the pleasure of the president, who can change its size and portfolio so in 1977 President Jimmy Carter abolished the PFIAB, but President Ronald Reagan re-established it later. On February 29, 2008, President George W. Bush renamed the agency to its present form. Most of the board's work is secret, but one very public investigation involved the loss of U.S. New nuclear secrets to China from the Los Alamos National Laboratory during the 1990s. Intelligence Oversight Board President Gerald Ford created the IOB following a 1975–76 investigation by the U.S. Congress into domestic spying, assassination operations, and other abuses by intelligence agencies. His executive order doing so went into effect on March 1, 1976. In 1993, the IOB became a committee of the PFIAB, under Executive Order No. 12863 of President Bill Clinton. One of the IOB's functions is to examine violations of the laws and directives governing clandestine surveillance. The IOB received quarterly and annual reports from most U.S. intelligence activities. Thirteen cases involving FBI actions between 2002 and 2004 were referred to the IOB for its review. In an executive order issued on February 29, 2008, President George W. Bush terminated the IOB's authority to oversee the General Counsel and Inspector General of each U.S. intelligence agency, and erased the requirement that each Inspector General file a report with the IOB every three months. The order also removed the IOB's authority to refer a matter to the Justice Department for a criminal investigation, and directed the IOB to notify the President of a problem only if other officials are not already adequately addressing that problem. In August 2013, it was reported that the membership of the IOB had been reduced from 14 to 4 under President Barack Obama, possibly starting in early May at the beginning of the 2013 mass surveillance disclosures by Edward Snowden. The membership had not been increased as of July 2014. Topic Membership During the administration of George W. Bush, the PIAB had 16 members selected from among distinguished citizens outside the government who were qualified. 
on the basis of achievement, experience, independence, and integrity. The members were not paid. PIAB membership is generally considered public information, for example, the Clinton administration posted the names of the members on a PFIAB web page. Topic PFIAB membership Under George W. Bush in August 2002, Randy Deitering, the executive director of PFIAB, confirmed the membership list released by the White House Press Office in October 2001. Brent Scowcroft, the chair Pete Wilson, a former governor of California Crescencio S. Arcos Jr., an AT&T executive and former U.S. Ambassador Jim Barksdale. Former head of the Internet company Netscape Robert Addison Day, chairman of the TWC Group, a money management firm Stephen Friedman, past chairman of Goldman Sachs Alfred Lerner, chief executive of MBNA Ray Lee Hunt, scion of the Texas oil fortune Rita Hauser, a prominent lawyer David E. Jeremiah, a retired Admiral Arnold Cantor, a national security official in the George H. W. Bush administration and a founding member of the Scowcroft Group James C. Langdon Jr., a power lawyer in Texas Elizabeth Pate Cornell, Chair of Management Science and Engineering at Stanford University John Harrison Stryker, a real estate magnate Philip Zelikov, a National Security Council staffer during the George H. W. Bush administration and later a counselor to Secretary of State Condoleezza Rice in 2000 2003 there were indications of spying on members of the board by a foreign intelligence asset. PIAB membership under Barack Obama The entire PIAB membership that served under the administration of George W. Bush resigned as part of an agreed-upon move in the presidential transition of Barack Obama, Prey. Obama appointed Chuck Hagel, former United States Senator from Nebraska, and current University of Oklahoma President David L. Boren as PIAB co-chairs. The following other members were appointed to the board under President Obama. Roll Campos Richard Danzig appointed on December 1, 2010 Lee H. Hamilton Rita Hauser Paul G. Kaminsky Ellen Lapson, President and CEO of the Henry L. Stimson Center Les Lyles Daniel Meltzer appointed on December 1, 2010 Jamie Mischik appointed December 23, 2009 Mona Sutphin appointed on September 6, 2011 Philip Zelikov appointed on September 6, 2011 Tom Wheeler appointed on April 27, 2011 In May 2013, the White House dismissed ten members of the board. The four remaining members of the PIAB were Richard Danzig Daniel Meltzer Judith Mischik Mona Sutphin Topic PIAB Chairs PIAB Chairpersons have been Topic IOB Chairs These are chairs of the Advisory Boards Committee of Intelligence Oversight Board. Topic Board Executive Directors nineteen fifty six to nineteen fifty nine John Cassidy nineteen fifty nine to nineteen sixty one nineteen sixty one to nineteen seventy Patrick Coyne nineteen seventy to nineteen seventy three Gerard Burke 
1973–1977, Wheaton Byers 1977, Lionel Ulmer 1977–1981, Board abolished 1981–1983, Norman Wood 1983–1984, Fred de Meck 1984–1988, Gary Schmidt 1988–1989, Fred de Meck 1989–1991, Nina Stewart 1991–1992, Vacant 1992–1995, Eugene Yates 1995–2003, Randy Deitering, Acting, 1995–1998 2003 to 2005, Joan Dempsey. 2005 to 2017, Stephanie Osborne. Topic: Board members. Topic: See also. Team B Privacy and Civil Liberties Oversight Board